All right, so here's the main story of the day. Oh, I just sent you an email uh, before, uh, after everything at the very last second from Yashar Ali, one of the worst people in the world. He's a homo from Iran who uh, can't wait to throw his parents under the bus and talk about how horrible they are and how Iran treats gays. But at the same time, he's an immigrant, so he talks about how racist America is and how Iranians are mistreated and basically just constantly complaining and whining about his lot in life where we took him in from one of the shittiest countries in the world. Uh, like, check out 1-9. Charlie Kirk, the Groypers left to shit on him. I don't like all this, this dissent within the right. We need unity. And I was watching this the other day and I just thought, Charlie Kirk is a national treasure. And when you shit on him because you disagree on one stupid thing, you deny us a really effective activist who is going to college campuses and telling these imbeciles how far off they are. But it seems you agree Iran's an evil? I think that Saudi, I think, well, my point. Oh, the little hesitancy? My, is Iran and Saudi Arabia both enemies of the West? Uh, no, I don't, I don't believe wow. that at all. So Iran funding so, Hamas and Hezbollah is what? Would you say that? Good? I think that um, Iran is I the number the, one terrorist funder. I think in the, world. the Palestinian people and the Lebanese people have the right to defend themselves from Israel. Hamas is not defending themselves. Yes, They're they a are. terrorist organization targeting they Jews, they launching Demo rockets into this nation state of Israel every single day. Sorry. Guys, Hamas is see. not Palis Palestinian. Hamas and Hezbollah are terrorist organizations that They're are still on Twitter, by the way. Total destruction Actually, of the rightful nation state of Israel. That's completely untrue. Hamas. It's Hamas. There. We were there. Hamas has repeatedly expressed acceptance of the two-state solution. Bull the shit. Okay. Well, the terrorism that Hamas and Hezbollah are responsible. For responsible for pales in comparison with the terrorism that Israel and the United States carry out on a regular so, basis. Two quick things. First of all, Ayatollah Khamenei, the head of Iranian's theocratic construction, essentially part of government, and the former president, Ahmadinejad, said death to Israel, death to the West, death to America multiple times. Yeah. How do they act on it? Because you said it's just words. They give billions to Hamas. They give billions to Hezbollah. They support the bombing of Israeli children. They give money to PA that funds and incentivizes terrorist behavior. They refuse to condemn Hamas and Hezbollah any time under UN resolutions, ever. They refuse to ever vote and say this is wrong. They refuse, they actually fund BDS resolutions all across the world. That's the boycott They're Israel outwardly thing. outwardly anti-Semitic, not to mention outwardly anti-gay, anti-Christian, anti-Western. And finally, why does Iran want nuclear weapons so bad? Why? Because they want to act on their words to destroy Israel, destroy the West, destroy America. Iran is the fundamentally biggest and most sinister evil of everybody in this room. And if you have sympathy for it, I wonder why. Don't you hate Muslims with British accents? That just bothers me. <laughs> you went to some hoity-toity British school because we allowed your Iranian parents to come here and be rich and you take our British education and talk about how evil the West is with your wonderful rich smart British learning Hello, I would just like to start this with saying that I <laughs> feel absolutely no gratitude to Britain for taking me in and educating me and sending me to the finest schools uh, in fact I, I think they're terrorists and I think that the, what the Palestinians and Hamas are doing pales in comparison with, the, oh, the evil imperialist scum. That's Ilhan Omar, too, talking about Somalia. Oh, I have PTSD from when America invaded us. Uh, America invaded Mogadishu to help the people get the aid they were sending uh, because a warlord was keeping it for himself. And by the way, we took in thousands of refugees Including you, you ugly bitch. I wonder what's under that skull cap, that do rag she got on. Just like pubes. Ew. My pubes. You, ever see, you see that meme where like yeah, it, yeah. they photoshop That's it? That's really gro graphic to oh, me. Oh, photoshopping is evil, by the way. Say what? I'm going to get to that in censorship.